Good morning. Laura and I are honored to welcome Prime Minister John Howard and his wife Jeanette back to the White House. Prime Minister Howard, you and I stood together here at the White House the day before September the 11th, 2001. And our nations have stood together on every day afterwards. The American people know that Australia is a strong ally. The fighting men of our two countries first joined together on the 4th of July 1918 at the Battle of Hamel. But our cause is a just cause. Terrorism respects no value system. Terrorism does not respect the tenets of the great religions of the world. Terrorism is based on evil, intolerance and bigotry. And no free societies such as Australia and the United States can ever buckle under to bigotry and intolerance. We'll feed him tonight. Well, I suspect he's going to outlast me, so that is a moot point. <laughs> Probably a question you ought to ask him. Somebody said, don't you, you, you and John Howard appear to be so close, don't you have any differences? And I said, yeah, he doesn't have any hair. <laughs> uh, the war against terror will go on for a long time. I think we have to accept that. Progress is being made. Uh, the challenge remains uh, uh, very, very strong, and there needs to be a continued commitment. Thanks, sir. Enjoyed it. Appreciate Thank you. It. Thank you. Appreciate Thank you. It. 